with the white straw hat Imagine this and imagine that My name is Jack, my guitar on my back I've been to many places, seen a lot of faces Something new to share with you Let's explore a thing or two Read along, sing along I'm Jack Grunsky. I'm the man with the white straw hat. Hello. Do you have a favorite bird? I love birds. Maybe you like blue jays, canaries, budgies. What about cardinals, or sparrows, swallows? I love birds. I have a favorite one. Mine happens to be the very colorful and beautiful macaw. And of course, the macaw lives in the rainforest, in the jungle, South America. I even wrote a song about a macaw, and I made a video which I'd love to show you right now. The voices that you're going to hear are my daughter, Cosima, singing together with me in a duet for the song, Maka. Hope you enjoy it. Of all the birds on earth, one leaves me in awe. Color, grace, and beauty, the magnificent macaw. Deep in the jungle, the rainforest trees, this bird is soaring high up on the breeze. Orange and yellow, often scarlet too, bright green or golden or a shiny ocean blue. Intelligent and social, cracking nuts and seeds. Hear their squawks and cries as their little chicks they feed. Talking about the bird macaw, the prettiest bird I ever saw. Talking about the bird macaw, the beautiful macaw. Of all the birds on earth, one leaves me in awe. Such color, grace, and beauty, the magnificent macaw. Orange and yellow, often scarlet too. Bright green or golden or a shiny ocean blue. Talking about the bird macaw. The prettiest bird I ever saw. Talking about the bird macaw. Deep in the jungle, the rainforest trees, this bird is soaring high up on the breeze. Talking about the bird macaw, the prettiest bird I ever saw. Talking about the bird macaw, the beautiful macaw. Oh, I'm talking about Did you like Cosima's voice? I'll introduce you to Cosima very soon. Before I show you how I made that video, I want to show you this painting. It's an abstract painting inspired by the music of Igor Stravinsky.
the fire bird. And this is my interpretation of the fire bird. Very abstract. <laughs> anyway, let me show you how I made that video. Okay, so here we are. Here's the bird that I showed you. I cut it out and painted it and its wings are spread apart. Now look at the display of all the different cutout birds that I made in different shapes and sizes. You can tell this is the one bird that first appears and flies around and he's, the bird is just sitting and uh, here he's cleaning himself under his wings, you know how birds behave. <laughs> and then he's spreading its wings. Down here is the other bird that appears in the video. And I cut each one out. And here are the images of the birds as they're flying. That's the one bird that I put on the uh, background. And the background is right over here. There's the painting of the jungle. So, first we'll take one bird and I'll put him right there on the branch. And with my camera, I take a picture of it. Click! That's when I take a picture. Now, what I'm going to do is take the same bird, but the different version, and replace it right there. So now he's looking over to that side. And I go click, and then put the other bird there, and now he's looking over there. And again I go click. Let's make him fly. So first of all, I'll take this one where he's spread, it's spreading its wings a little bit, getting ready to fly. So once again, click, we have another picture of that one. And now he's spreading his wings even further. And again, click. <laughs> Shall we make him fly up into the sky? Here we go. Watch this. Here the, here's the macaw with his wings spread. So once again, click. And now we're going to change the scene and the bird will fly up right from the bottom. So he'll come into the picture. First you see his head, its head and the wings. And then uh, I take a picture, click. And now he's coming into the scene, flying into the picture, click again. I think you get the idea. You see what I'm doing? One picture at a time, click and flying into the distance. I import all of those pictures into my computer and just line up the images one after the other and when you scroll through it and let it run then you can see the flow of the birds flying around. And the same principle is used in the flip book that perhaps you could make. I'll show you. Draw a picture of a bird flying on each page. Change it a little bit each time. Flip through the book and watch your bird fly. Maybe someone can help you. Hope you enjoyed that. See you next time. straw hat. Imagine this and imagine that. My name is Jack, my guitar on my back. I've been to many places, seen a lot of faces, something new to share with you. Let's explore.